Yeah. All right. Hello. Hello. Here we are in the rental van again. <laughs> Hello, Fiber Hearts fans. Hi. People of the yarn. People who like to yarn. A big welcome to all of you new subscribers. Yay. Yeah, thank you for following us. Excuse me. Oh my goodness. Did you did you just let out an Effingham, dude? <laughs> oh my gosh. You better explain what you just said. Oh, all right. So we're in where are we, dear? We're in Effingham, Illinois, yes. and we ain't making that up. No. Nope. No, we ain't. We think the name is a little funny. That's because a funny name. It sounds like you're trying not to cuss when you're talking about a ham. Uh-huh. And we just find that amusing because That's well, funny. I, I'm I about, don't care who you are, that's funny. I, I don't know about the rest of you, but I'm about fourteen years old on the inside, so stuff like that makes me laugh. Yeah. Anyway, so we just went to this wonderful Dig. place <laughs> called the Gabby Goat the Gabby Roadhouse. Goat Roadhouse yep. Restaurant <laughs> in uh, Effingham, Illinois. <laughs> oh man! First off, can I just say that Midwesterners have perfected fried cheese? <laughs> yes, yes, they have. What you do see? Wow! Is you get your macaroni and cheese on? Yeah. But don't you know the little powdery cheese packets that you yeah. make no, with it? No 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 no, 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 no! You got to use the Gouda. Yeah, that's the real the Gouda stuff. kind. Yeah, the really fatty. Yeah. And you gotta and gouda. bread it all up and deep fry it. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> when I get back to California, I'm gonna have to go on a celery kale juice, kale juice uh, fast or something. Fast Holy or something. smokes! Yeah. And then they had this. They had a world famous horseshoe. The yeah, horseshoe. we learned. I had eat, never heard of this before. Eat the horseshoe dinner or yeah, well, lunch or whatever. That's supposed to be lunch. You know that? I, that was supposed I to be lunch. Can't even imagine eating wow. that. Wow. We split this thing called a horseshoe. So We split it. We still couldn't finish the thing. I bet the rest of you know what it is, but for anybody who happens to not know what oh. a horseshoe is, you take two slices of bread, <laughs> and then you take two your choice of a burger patty <laughs> and pulled pork or two burger patties or all pulled yeah, pork, and then you, you ladle slather it, it in sauce, yeah. and then you pile on some fries. Pound of french fries. And then... You put cheese sauce on top. Yeah, like three ladles of nacho cheese on the top. Yes, yes. Oh, my I gosh. Oh, I man. looked at that thing. I didn't know where to begin. I was like. Well, you start at the top, but you had to reach up to get to it. Oh, my goodness. And then, and then we're asking the gal, do people eat this? I mean, they, like, eat the whole thing? Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, 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 all, all the time. time, all the time. Oh, now they usually put, like, coleslaw and whatever on the top. Yeah, they put three like, or four other things on top. Wow. Yeah. Anyway, see, my problem is I don't awesome. go plow the back forty well, afterwards. That, these people do because in Effingham it's farm country. Yeah, and there's a be beautiful farmland. You hear that all train around. going by? Yeah, that, that's we are not camp. in Sacramento right now. No, no, we're not. <laughs> so, good news, Effingham, I believe, has they don't have no Michaels. No, no, no. no we no. checked. We, you know, they don't got no Joanne's uh, Crystal either. from Bag o Day, she lives in a in a yarn desert <laughs> this you is what guys i live think. in a yarn desert because like there's no there's no, no michaels nothing. no joanne's no nothing when she says she got to drive it at least an hour to get there she means it she I ain't kidding around why. she's yeah. serious man yep but anyway i think we're gonna go to the hobby lobby here in effingham Check out the hobby lobby. i think this is the new hobby lobby she's been talking about because there's no be. michaels there's no joanne's no, no. But there's a Hobby Lobby around and, and here there's somewhere. there's a Walmart. There's a Walmart Supercenter, and there's a, a Hobby Lobby. Yeah. And they're both out by the highway. Yeah. So we're going to go check them and out. And interestingly enough, I've been needing to go to a Hobby Lobby. Well, I actually have a couple of things I need really, to really? Have you really been needing know, to go? I know. It's a shock. It's I'm a shock. I'm so surprised. <laughs> it's a shock. I've been needing to go, too. I don't know why. We're going to go check it out. Okay. But later today, we kick off the retreat. Yep, 5 p.m. And at 5 o'clock. We drove so, by. We drove by where it's supposed to be. We did. Yep. We drove we did by the, we know people are busy the Mexican restaurant where it's supposed to be in the back. Yep. <laughs> so, anyway, we'll keep you up to date. Awesome. Yep. Thanks for stopping by. Yep, thanks for if stopping you haven't subscribed by. yet, click subscribe button. See Dang. you later. See All you right. soon. See you soon. Bye. Okay, bye.